Let's get going. Um, shoot. Whatever. There is a guide I'm supposed to follow to do this. But, uh, it wouldn't matter much. Just retest this real quick and make sure. that it's still not working. Yep, as you can see there, replace the battery. Battery does not match. I tried already replacing it once. I got the official iFixit kit. And uh, is there no audio? The audio, there should be audio, right? Okay, yeah, um, anyways. Uh, yeah, I got the official one from, uh, from iFixit about a month ago, and it didn't work. Like, it just came up with this message on the, spleen, uh, on the screen. Replace the battery. Battery does not match. So, uh, let's go ahead and try and put in the replacement. Oh my gosh, I did not put chat on uh, stream where I want it. Anyhow, anyhow. Ah, okay. Let's see if I remember how to do this because I did it the other day and There's one side, oh, I got, start with the screws, start with the screws. So the kit that they sent actually came even with this uh, iFixit driver handle, but it's not the best. It's, it's just, it's actually plastic and rubber, but it's, it's not bad. But if I've got the official, like actual kit here with the aluminum or steel, whatever it is, um, I'm gonna use that instead. Let's see, we should be using, what is this? This is like, torque something or other. I'll just use whatever one that they included in the, in the kit here. Should be, up. Oh, it's the smaller one. So it comes with a torque uh, T5, and it comes with, what is this little guy here? A T3. Go ahead and get going. Are you are you kidding me? Is that the wrong size? There's no way they included two bits that are the wrong size. What size is this supposed to come with? That's definitely not fitting. Bizarre. One. Where the heck? Let's try the T3. Yeah, there we go. It's a T2. They included a T3. It's a T2. That's crazy. There's one screw out. Let's uh, try not to lose anything. I'll use this little tray that they included. Oh, wait a second. Is that it there? No. Yeah, they, okay, so they do include it. It's just in this little package instead of in the toolkit that they provided. I don't know. Um, well, whatever. Oh, I need to, need to pop out the SIM as well. Let's put the little screw over in this tray too. <clears throat> Before I take out the other one, I'm going to remove the SIM. I feel like I should be moving the camera down a little bit more to get everything centered. How's that? Is that a little bit better? If I'm like working on stuff now, is it like right in the middle? So hard to, to know. I've never done a, a head-mounted camera before like this. So, I feel like that. This is a pretty 
centered and bending over. Yeah, okay. There we go. And audio is pretty clear or what? Well, whatever. I hope it's clear. OCD, everything's not completely straight. Which way does it need to go? It needs to go like this. Oops. Clear, just low compared to other applications running. Um, Sorry. I can move the lav, try and uh, brighten up the audio a little bit, but I'm not sure how much good that'll do right now. Okay, back to it. I need to get this done. I don't have all day for this. Uh, as much as I would love to spend all day repairing electronics. That again for a little bit. Let's put that back. A lot of my mics are tuned for uh, when I'm gaming, which means when I'm...
Oh hi, I'm still here to support this bot real jam, one love. about now can you hear me now yeah on the fly battery replacement too bad it's not um, hot swap but like whatever it's better than nothing uh, come on just slide back onto the headband there we go that's probably okay, and we'll put the little windscreen back on. Sorry. Worth it, I promise. Okay. All right, all right. So where were we? Uh, I was saying something about how it's super useful. Uh, super useful to have an extra smartphone around not only as a backup but like because when you're for streaming like when I did the when I had my dogs over uh, I could have all these extra camera angles that were wireless because it's just a battery powered webcam um, this is the phone you burnt burned the battery to it what I didn't burn any battery what are you talking about this is the phone I, I can show you guys the um, the original battery later, but it's really swollen and those are dangerous to handle, so I have it sort of put away already. Anyways, let's get into the rest of this, which means, let's see, how's, how is that? Okay, this is not the best lighting for this, but it's what I got. All right, um... I could follow the guide, but I'm pretty sure I can do this from here without the guide. So, need to remove the connectors from the main board to the daughter board. And I think that starts here by removing this little Phillips head screw. I'll just leave that off to the side there. And then this piece comes off there, that's the retention bracket. Um, yeah, I don't know what you mean by burn the battery. It just, like, if you mean it's the phone that I left plugged in for a very long time and the battery started to swell, yes. That is what this is. There's another one too I'm supposed to unscrew, I think. Or not. Whatever. Let's just go for it. Uh... Now they want you to use this little pick thing to pry up these little connectors here. So let's see, hopefully you guys can see what, what we're doing in here. There you go. These connectors are very fragile, so you don't want to screw around with them too much. Come on. There we go. They'll come down the other side here and get to this end. Pretty sure, yep. There we go, got it. Leave that off to the 
side. And then this one you just have to kind of bend out of the way. Um, now I have to get, this is the actual battery connector right here. So let's go ahead and, oh, not. There we go, got it. We'll keep that off to the side now too. And if I'm not mistaken, this is the part where you just have to kind of go for it. So there's this little plastic tab. We're just going to have to yank the battery up out of the, uh, the rest of the phone. Now, luckily, when I reassembled it, I was lazy. Oh, gosh, that is really stuck in there. <laughs> um, I was lazy, I was saying, and didn't put all the adhesives that it told me to put in. Like, it comes with... Where is it? Oh, yeah, all of this stuff, this whole sheet of uh, adhesive stuff that's really, really... So it's thin and really sticky. Um, and I only put a couple strips in, but golly, wow. Oof. That's, that's really, that's in there. It doesn't help that my fingers are a tiny bit sweaty right now. Um, oh, I heard something. It's starting to give. But holy cow, that's slow and painful too strong <laughs> yeah we will get there we're getting it ah! i'm giving her all i got ah! that's that's uh, okay i yeah there's no other screws that's just adhesive under this this entire back piece but i only put like one and two strips or something when you're supposed to like cover the entire back with it if i did that oh my gosh they, you know i'd just have to throw those away at this point holy cow it's just a tiny little piece of plastic that i got like look at that that's what i'm trying to to grab onto right now this is kind of dumb okay more coffee All right. Energy replenished. We're going for it. Oh, I'm just slipping off. Uh. Oops, sorry. That's the microphone. <laughs> Don't mind me. Okay. Uh, I'm going to try and get something wedged in there to help me pry it up. Problem is, you don't want to use anything sharp, because if you puncture a lithium battery, you get fire. Yeah, like, I, mm, yeah. Okay, I'm going to look at the guide again, so that I know that I'm allowed to just rip and tear. Yeah, I did all that stuff, did all that stuff. Remove the battery. Yep, did that. Removed that, removed that, da 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 da, yes. Yeah, I didn't even reattach the tape that's supposed to be there. Uh, you don't need to push any, da da da, yep, peel that, and then just really go for it. Yep, that's, that's it, just really yankee yankee. Mm-hmm, and okay. Ooh. There's no, uh, no easy way about this. We're just going to hold it down. They're holding it kind of like this. I hear it giving a little bit every time I pull, but holy cow. This is dumb. And I don't even have a hair dryer to like heat it up. <sighs> this was supposed to be quick and easy. I've got gloves. They're right over there but I'm actually tethered in right now. There's a cable running to the GoPro all the way back to my computer. So 
I can't actually go over there and get those gloves. Just trying to think if there's anything else I could use right now to help him. Oops, I hit the mic again. Use the light to heat it up. This is an LED bulb. So, uh, by the way, just touching the bulb right now. Yeah. It's bright, but not hot. Mm, kind of like me. I don't have a heat gun. I, I've been thinking about buying one for a long time. And I just never got around to it. So, yeah. Okay, we're just going to go for it, even though my thumb hurts. We just got to... Mm, come on. Oh, gosh. Got to dry off the sweat. This makes me so sad. I was so close. <sighs> Come on, you gotta give me at least something. If that tab break, yeah, man. I, I'm worried about that too, but it's really strong. I'm just trying to think right now, is there anything else I have that might help me do this? Try left-handed. I am not left-handed. My left hand is definitely weaker. Okay, swap hands. Keep going. It's starting to move. Can you see that? Ah! Hey, vape, va vapor, use your shirt to make... My shirt, this is a smooth plastic tab, and my shirt is not latex. My shirt is fabric. I'm pretty sure it would just slip. Yeah, but there's no, there isn't enough gap for that, and if you accidentally cut or puncture a lithium battery, um, I said this earlier, you get fire, you get bad things, you get a huge mess and I don't want that <laughs> try it easy clap oh yeah no I'm not desperate enough to risk things that badly but like here we'll use the we'll use the little plastic spudger thing no th there is no gap there just isn't a gap this this now becomes a two man job because someone has to hold the phone down, someone has to be pulling up, and then someone has to slide this under. Tempted to just pull by this connector, but no, 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 definitely not. Whew. <clears throat> I don't. Uh, I have a clamp. I but it's not it's not nearly strong enough. My only thought is I'm gonna get my my uh my gloves, but I can't actually go. Let's see, how far does this tether let me go? Not far enough. Or just barely far enough. Glove acquired. Wow. All right. I have baseball gloves that I use for uh, Beat Saber when my hands get sweaty to keep my grip from slipping. So let's see if the same logic applies here. Mm, I. Oh, maybe, maybe. It's better than my bare hands.
Definitely better than the bare hands. Oh gosh, man. <laughs> I swear, I only put a tiny bit of that adhesive stuff in here. Why is this so hard? Oh, the tab is starting to weaken. No. <sighs> this is actually starting to make me sweat. Okay, we're we're I am I am seeing progress here. Trying to ah, uh, I'm I'm tempted to use my foot. Okay, I'm actually about to use my foot to hold the phone down. <laughs> Should I do it? Hmm. How desperate am I? Pretty desperate right now. We're gonna go for it. Yes. Okay. Hold that on both sides. <laughs> no, there we go. That's enough. I got it wedged in there. Okay. Um. Problem is, you don't want to bend the battery either. Yeah. Oh, it's starting to give. It's starting to give. Can you guys hear that? Probably can't hear that because the gain's turned down on this, uh, on this lav mic. <laughs> Turn it up, but then, uh, I'll be deaf by now. But you've got to be okay. That's it. We're just we're gonna try and pry all the way across. Ah! I slipped. Oh yeah, that wasn't coming out unless I did this. This is dumb. Like the amount of stuck that this is, is ridiculous. Okay, no, glove has to stay on. This isn't... 
Like, I just can't get a grip on that tab otherwise. Oh, there we go. I heard, you hear that, right? Ah, come on! Oh, sh is it breaking? No breaking. Please, don't break. Oh, shit. Oh, there we go. Oh, this glue smells awful, by the way. See what I mean? Look, I just did this one little strip on this one side and the other side. Oh. There we go. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> <No>. <laughs> we're good we're good we're good we're good we're good okay battery is out oh gosh okay gloves off okay ah uh, coffee finished battery is out Dang, that's uh. Wait a second, does this look different than the other battery that they sent? Mm, looks to be just about the same exact thing. I really hope this new one works. Or I will have wasted <clears throat> a lot of time for no clear reason. And also, um, should be known that you're supposed to reuse this little sticky tab thing. Yeah, about that. That little guy's not <laughs> not doing too good. Mmm, that's that is unfortunate. But we have to try and reuse that. Okay. Man, that glue smells awful. I mean, this battery technically still does things. Except that it didn't work. My phone. Okay. You're supposed to clear off all the old tape. So let's just remove that and leave that over there in that tray. Please get off of my finger. There we go. You're supposed to clean off the rest of it, which I tried to do last time. Um, with results as you have seen. This time, I'm going to put a really small amount of uh, tape. Let's open it from here. Yep, that looks pretty much exactly the same. Let's see, was there actually... Mm, oh, this one didn't... Ooh, this is different. Wow. All right. Well, that gives me some hope. TN1909, TM... Uh, no, yeah, okay. So there are some differences here. Some minor, minor differences. I'm honestly tempted to not even glue it in. Like, what happens if I just, like... No, wait, whoa, whoa, almost did it without the plastic uh, tab. <laughs> That'd be a bad time. Be a real bad time. So let's go ahead and get a tiny, tiny piece of this dumb, strong adhesive. 
we can use maybe a couple of these little squares instead. I, I did like one of these long strips last time, uh, but they have these tiny little squares of it here. We're going to go maybe like the tabs on this side. I want it to be easy to lift it up. That means I want to get it some leverage on whatever's in the, so I'll put like one in the middle here. I'll, I'll put, I'm putting two of these tiny little squares. You see those? These right up here in the top. Two of those. That's it. So if I ever have to open this up again, which honestly, if this doesn't work, I'm just, I'm done. I'm going to go complain to um, iFixit's support group again, which they were very helpful, by the way. iFixit is awesome. I like their stuff and I like their support. But I'm not going to try again. I will let them know, though, so that other people don't have to go through this nonsense. Please, just let me take, take your adhesive. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh, it's not coming. Oh, no. There we go. We got one. Go ahead and... Plop her down right there. Not the prettiest, but is it ever going to matter? No. Not even. I'll put you right there. That's it. Done. That's all the adhesive this battery will ever need. Okay? Um, but then I'm also going to make sure that this tab sticks back on by using uh, one of these. Because I am not about to be letting this. Yeah, it's not sticky at all anymore. We're just going to do this and hope that this works for the future. Good enough, right? <laughs> okay. Uh, reinstalling. Let's peel off these little sticky backings. And go for it. Close enough. And we'll go ahead and you're supposed to reconnect the battery tab uh, last. So we'll do that last. Get everything reconnected and uh, be able to test it out pretty quickly and know whether or not this was worth anyone's time at all. Okay, we got that one daughter board connector thingy in. Now we have to put in the main connector cable thingy. Gonna do it by hand because I can. It's in. If you push these in at an odd angle, it can break them real easy. So you gotta be very careful that they're lined up. And then you just kind of apply pressure from the center. So it goes in straight. There we go. Theoretically, I could try to power this on as soon as I put the uh, battery in there. Let's see. Uh, excuse me. We're in. Ah, oh, shiz. Now we're in. Okay. Um, that's the power button right there. So uh, let's 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 try it.
I'm I'm done. We're done. It says replace the battery. Battery does not match. Replace the battery. There's 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 no nope. No, we're 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 out of out of here. Done. Failed. Mission failed. I'm gonna be contacting iFixit again. Um, so, I hope you guys had fun for the last 40 minutes. I know, <laughs> all that work for nothing. I'm gonna send, I'm gonna send iFixit this video. And I'm sure they won't like the way that I tore it apart and the way that I didn't completely follow the instructions. Um, and maybe they'll be able to tell me what I can do to fix it based on that. But from what I can see, it just ain't gonna go. That's a real shame. Uh, let's, let's try. You know, here's an official OnePlus charger. We're going to plug this bad boy right in and see if maybe it just needed to be charged a bit. Nope. Replace the battery. Battery does not match. Which means it's probably not even going to try to charge itself. Yeah. I don't think anything's going to happen if I just leave it plugged in. No, like if I try to power it on while this is happening. Nope. Nothing. Still nothing. Still just says, replace the battery. Battery does not match. Ah. I'm very sad. Very sad. Okay. Um, I'm going to just for the heck of it, leave it plugged in here. Uh, but I am not going to reseal the, the unit until after I'm sure that there's nothing else I can do. We're just going to leave that there. Maybe it, maybe it just needs some charge, but from what I read, there's nothing that's going to fix it from saying that message. So we'll keep this adhesive in case there's anything I need to stick in the feature that I never want to ever come undone again, because that stuff is stupid. And uh, we're done. We're done. This will just this will just stay here. Yeah. Just just. What's all that? Oh, all the sensors. Yeah. There's there's. Oh, that's is that the haptic motor? No. Earpiece speaker? No, that is the haptic motor. Yeah. You see the little piece that would swing around in order to generate the the um, sensation of touch. Pretty cool. So much, so much technology in such a small piece of milled, whatever this is, steel, aluminum. Very strong, too. Nice. Okay, we're done. Um, gonna cut stream, and I'll be back on, yeah, I'll be back in just a moment and probably be playing some Valorant. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace? Does this work? Sure.